on the couch one time, it was me and Dynamite and one of her daughters on the other end of the couch, right? And the daughter goes, or Dynamite, right, she goes, uh, she goes, uh, to her daughter, she goes, hey, pour me another drink, right? And the daughter goes, Dynamite, I think you've had enough. And Dynamite fucking snaps! She loses it, give me another drink! And then she, she, she lays into the Catholic guilt. She's like, I could be dead tomorrow. How would that make you feel if I didn't get a drink right now? I could be dead tomorrow. So the daughter breaks down and leaves to get her a drink. The dynamite turns to me. She goes, I'm going to fucking live forever. I'm going to bury her. <laughs> That's the woman who raised me. She's awesome. But you still got to call her on her shit like dynamite. You can't say that about your daughter. That's it's sick. It's twisted. And she looks at me. She's like, I'm sick. I'm twisted. You're the one who thinks about me naked so you don't come too soon. <laughs> That's fucked up. And how does she know that? How does... Little old ladies aren't supposed to know that kind of information. Your next act coming to the stage. Uh, Graham, it's not you. There's one more than you. Sorry, buddy. Sorry. Everyone's fucked up. I'm sorry, dude. Oh. Okay, I win the award tonight for worst host. This is all my bad. I didn't give everyone the proper... Uh, please welcome Van Dad Cardar, everybody. Let him hear it. Van Dad. Yes, up baby girl. Yeah, you like that. I saw that. Uh-huh. Talk after the show. How you guys doing? Yeah. You guys having fun? Yeah. You know it. You know it. Do I? How do I know it? Who said that? Show yourself. How do I know it? Yeah, that's true. Right. He passed the test. He passed the test, guys. Give it up for him. Yeah, my parents are here. Thank you. Sorry. I told them that I'm there at 9 o'clock. I'll be there at 9. But I hopped on another show because I really need the 20 bucks. So... It was a good, no, it's a great show too, you should check it out. But uh, no, it's on this night, so don't ever go be here. It's a, I've seen you here before. Yeah, all right. Can't get, can't get enough, huh? Woo! Woo! Yeah, we're in the village. How you guys doing? Who's repping the village vibe right now? Yeah, that's cool. That's cool. I, uh, I was visiting a friend. What's that? Uh, what did you say? No, I'm kidding. Uh, I was visiting a friend in the village, and uh, his classmate, just like he's, you know, he's gay. It doesn't matter. But, uh, but uh, whatever. We don't have to kill him. But, but <laughs> so I'm visiting my friend, and uh, I'm just saying hi. We're making some small talk, and then his like lover, boy toy, whatever, comes up, and is just like, "Have you two fucked?" <laughs> and my friend right away is like, "Oh Jesus Christ! No, no, no! Oh sweet Mary, no!" And they're like, "Okay," and he slaps him in the ass, and they like walk away together. And I'm just standing. What if we had fucked? What? Like, is that, would that have been so bad? Like, I don't want it, but like, you know, I, come on, hey, you don't know what I'm capable of, it might be great, like, I, come on, give me a chance, man. I don't, <laughs> you be careful what you preach, but no, it's, it's, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta sexy it up, you know what I mean? I love, I love, I love that there is the village, you know, it's great, uh, but I feel like they're kind of segregating you guys sometimes, too, they're like, I mean, I don't know, you guys, you guys might not be gay at all, but they're, they're like putting you, it's like they're, they're, they're putting you in one corner, you know what I mean? My friend, um, he gets laid a lot, but it's always on these like apps, right? And, and, and like gay versus like grinder and stuff, he'll, he'll text us and he'll be like, this is the address I'm going to tonight, just in case, dot, dot, dot. And we're like terrified that if our friend's okay, you know what I mean? Like just, my phone's dying, I'm like, what do you mean dot, dot, dot? Like don't do that, that's... So I took him, I took him out, and uh, I was wingmaning him, because he doesn't know how to, like, you know, just, like, pick up, so we, we, he just, he only knows how to do it online, it's like, hey, you want to fuck? Yes, okay, they show up. Like, he can't be like, hi, my name's Roberto. So we go to the village, and it's, like, almost last call, he doesn't make any moves, and we're hammered, and, like, we're, we're just, at, you know, whatever, so I'm like, listen, you gotta, you gotta at least try, even if you don't get any, you know what I mean? I used to be way fatter than I am now. I, I got used to rejection pretty quick, and that's why 
you know, I got the chutzpah now, you know what I mean? I can tell. But so, I'm like, you gotta, even if it doesn't work, just try it out. And uh, who do you like? Like, who do you like in here? And he's like, oh my god, the server. The server's so cute. I would do anything for the server. So I'm like, all right, Papa's gonna get you the server. Don't you worry about it. And uh, so I go right up to the server, point blank, are you single? He's like, yeah, actually I am. I'm like, okay, cool. Well, I'm not gay, don't get excited. But uh, my friend over there, he'll suck your dick. He'll, 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 I'm pimping my friend out, I'm like, he'll put it in you, he'll let you put it in, I don't even know what my friend's into, like, maybe they just wanted to talk, but I'm like, he'll fucking, whatever, baby, and, uh, he turns to me, and, uh, he's like, oh, I'm really flattered, but, uh, I'm not gay either, and we both knew exactly what to do, guys, we fucking high-fived, and then I just, I'm like, puke, like, I'm like, about to puke at this one, I just turn around, I'm like, you're all about your queer! But it's so loud that like you, all you can hear is Woo! like it just sounds like I'm pumping it up. So a bunch of bears are just like dancing with me. I'm like yeah. But I could have gotten laid. I could have gotten laid so easily there. I love I love uh, that we're so open these days because it really throws all the gender uh, mixes out of the window. You know what I mean? Like gender doesn't really mean anything in terms of personality. I I'm a weakling. I go work out with my lesbian friend and she puts it on maximum setting and she's just fucking killing it. And she chirps me too. She's like, you little bitch. He's like, she's like, I'm gonna get all the pussy tonight. You're not gonna get shit. Maybe you can have my sloppy seconds. Get on that fucking machine and I'm on there. Oh, oh, oh God. I just wanna find love. <laughs> Guys, every time I got laid, every time, immediately after, no matter how much I prep myself to be like, don't fall for her, don't put her on the next school, it's gonna be fine. Immediately after I come, I'm like, is this the one? Is she my new girlfriend? All I wanna do is smell her hair. <laughs> I wanna hold her tight and tell her everything's gonna be alright. But I also need her to hold me tight and tell me everything's gonna be alright. It's a cold world, I don't know what's going on. I, uh, with my dad, my dad taught me a lot of like uh, philosophy, but like impartially, you know what I mean? Like, I remember one time we were walking by a homeless guy, and he's like, look at him, Van Dog. He had hopes and dreams just like you. He had good mother, good father, but he thought, oh, I don't need education. Get it how you live, guys. Thanks for having me. Thank you for Cal Post. Your next act uh, is all the way from LA. I'll wait for everyone to recollect. Your next act, uh, I've known him for many years.